In this video, I'm going to demonstrate to you how to use the read aloud function in Microsoft Word. This will be useful to you if you struggle with reading retention or if you are on the go and need to listen to your, um, your handouts, your module content. It's an alternative learning tool available to you and worth trying. So first to demonstrate using this um, Law of Torts handout, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the Review tab at the top of my Microsoft Word app and then you'll see the Read Aloud function in the top on the left hand side. So I can start from the beginning here or I can place the cursor anywhere within the, the text that I want to um, start reading from. Here I think I want to start reading from the first heading, so I'll place my mouse there, click, and then press read aloud. Defining tort. The derivation of the word tort is the Latin tortus which means twisted or crooked, and is commonly ascribed to the French tort which means wrong. So I'll pause there and I'll just demonstrate to you if you click on the settings to the right hand side you can change the reading speed so you can slow it down you can speed it up and you can also change the voice selection now this is useful for handouts um, but might also be useful if you need to read a case so i'm going to demonstrate to you now how to download a case um, or any Westlaw or Lexis document as a, a Word file. So here I'm on the case of Donahue and Stevenson. If I go to the right hand side of the screen to this toolbar and click download, I'm able to change the format here to Microsoft Word. And then I would click download. The same sort of principle applies for Lexis, but here the toolbar is at the top so if I click on this button, again, it will bring me to a screen where I can choose format options and I can choose Word document from that drop down menu and then click download. So I downloaded one earlier to demonstrate to you. Here's Donahue and Stevenson. This was downloaded from Westlaw. Now I might choose to read from um, the beginning uh, here of this paragraph again I go to the review tab and I click read aloud by an action brought in the court of session the appellant who was a shop assistant sought to recover damages from the respondent who was a manufacturer of aerated waters for injuries she suffered as a result of consuming part of the contents of a bottle of ginger beer which had been manufactured by the respondent and which contained the decomposed remains of a snail so that demonstrates to you how to use that function.